The male species is incredible. An incredible waste of time. The Wrath and the Dawn is a story that captures that very greatly, but our main character, Shahrazad, is who we should start the main focus on. She has volunteered to be a queen, yay, who's supposed to be killed before sunrise, not so yay, by a male, even not so yay, whose name is Khalid. Now, she's not the only woman that has gone through this, but she is one that has come prepared, and this is how the story really begins. So now, we're learning little by little about her backstory, and her past best friend who's actually passed away because of this. Rest in peace, nothing but empathy for her, but let's keep going. So the night that she's supposed to meet Khalid, um, cut his throat, cut his throat, we learn that he is as arrogant as he is ugly, on some new levels. How are you, how, how, how is your nose built like a battery and you look like a bird? I don't like that. She and him are getting to converse and we get to learn that he's not exactly interested in talking. He's just trying to get her out of there. She's playing with him like a dog and she's trying to make him waste his time because her objective is to live past sunrise. Now, they did do adult things. Now how she did it, it's beyond me. That's some pro level acting right there, folks. Where the heck is her Oscar? Now, Khalid continues to ask Shahrazad why she chose to do this. She never gives him a flat out answer just to get him frustrated and to hold time. Now, she dances around the subject continuously and begins to tell him a story. It was about a thief named Agib and getting a pot. Now, this man, God, I hate him. Oh my God, I hate him. He really tries to rush the story, but guess what? He ends up getting hooked. Now, as the sun starts coming up, she stops the story at a cliffhanger and Agib is about to find something important. Now, Khalid is mad and she's successfully broken the routine and now she secured her safety by telling him to wait another day before she can finish. I don't know how she kept cool. I don't know how she kept cool. I was yelling, suck it for like five minutes straight. But now she has to hold herself together and survive even longer. And that's where you should start reading. Wrath and the Dawn is a very interesting story that I haven't seen before with such a scary setup with dying by this specific time in marriage. Like, how do you just get that title? How do you just give that title to someone and then just like end them off? Like, it, it, what? Now, it is a bit slow, but it's really good, I promise. Now, if you're really interested in a more old-time, desert-like, ancient, mystical, magical, all that type of stuff, this would be the type of thing for you. Now, I'm not too certain if it gets romantic. If it gets romantic with Khalid, I will have some personal problems. I'm gonna violate you and your security- The comic is called Wrath and the Dawn and is on the Webtoon app. Definitely make sure to go check it out and download the app too. My name's Asel Byzantine, and I'll see you guys out.